Let them laugh with a nigga, get comfy I'm from the six where bitches keep six and you get selfies Lovely, I hear him coming to the case He's just trying to smoke, I'm trying to light up his What up, what up, people? It's your boy, Inspire for Change. Hope everybody's good. Hope everybody's blessed. Yeah. Today, I've got some serious brothers with me. <laughs> Shout out my Say dog with the energy. Hey, <laughs> so all the way from the cities. <laughs> you gave me shah. Wah. Bow, you gave bow. me my brothers. Big up. Um, no, this is from the staircase, man. <laughs> oh. You lot. You guys have been putting on some crazy work since you come to London. Yeah, I love London. Bro. London London's our second home. Yeah, Lydia, you man, bro. you man to put it in, bro. I Lydia, see you, man. Fam. Get me, man. Yeah, man, we're here right now, man. So, man, that's what's up, man. No, thank you for having us. Thank you for having man, us. It's been a pleasure, man. Fam, let, let, me shout, let, me, let me shout out London for a second. It's been oh. mad love since we've been here. It's been lit. Bear hospitality. <laughs> Tell them about the facts, hospitality. Facts, facts. Well, Everyone's showing love. It's not like certain places where they're... Yeah. Everyone's acting bougie. Mm. You know? People are more acceptive here. That's why that's you. It's maybe why it's it sounds good. Maybe it's because we're not from here. Maybe yeah. that's the reason. You know how it is when people are not from around. Yeah, I know. It gets yeah. like that, man. But real recognize real, though. You know what I'm real saying? Real shout out to us. Shout out to everybody. Shout out to you. Shout out to uh, Elmi. Yeah, man. Uh, shout out to... Uh, shout out my dog. Shout out to the dogs shout in the shout south. Shout you know what I'm saying? Even take me around the streets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Trenches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Making me feel like I'm at home. Shout out to my brother. My, shout out to those guys. North, I, can't na- you know? I can't name those guys. Shout out to those guys. That's yeah, nice. Northwest. You know what I'm saying? All those people showed us love, you know? That's what's up, man. You already know what time it is. Once you once you guys come back to our sides. When they reciprocate it, you know what I'm saying? We're, we're, we're gonna run that back, you know? <laughs> you gotta run uh, that back, definitely. But yeah, you man, I just wanna show you, man. Like, all right, cool. What's up I with love, it, man? What's I up love, with I it? How long have you man be screaming this Marley? Uh, 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 Marley, yeah, have you guys been since birth? It? But from the jump, from the rip, he's like, not, not even on the. Yeah. Not, Yo, you know, what's, what's funny? Go on. When we first started this podcast, some people don't even think I'm Somali, you know? Swear down, yeah, well, like, they, a lot of people did not think I was Somali at the beginning. I think this guy's a bigger, like, uh, you know, like you're built different. Yeah, I'm looking, yeah, so you know what I'm saying? I don't know about that, but they think he's Ghanaian or something. Yeah, they know, they thought something else, but slowly but surely, people because they're used to seeing skinny, you know? skinny Somalis like me. I'm pretty, and I still believe I'm skinny, you know. Uh, but shout yeah, man, so shout, been, yeah, shout out my dog inspired for change. I want to put us on his regiment, man. Yeah, man, oh. inspired for change, you know, man, the Lotus, peace sign, all of that. All so, of do, that. do you do the, your workout on your um. Page? Bro, bro, I can't, man. See, I do my workout. No, yeah, I do my workouts. I'm just trying to motivate people. I'm a PT as well. I'm a personal trainer. I've oh, been a personal dope. trainer for oh, 10 years. Silly. I got yeah. my qualifications in prison. That's that's silly. Silly. That's I got good. a level three in personal training. Oh, that's good. That's, that's silly. That's, that's, yeah. the, that's the only thing that I was good at, bro. Like, yeah. I just like to motivate people, you saw? So, so I like, somehow I end up getting that in whilst in jail. So when I came out, I, obviously I wanted to come off the roads, innit, bro? Yeah. So I had to start to fall back on. Mm-hmm. Feel me? Mm-hmm. I fall back on that when I came out and mm-hmm. I started just doing that for a bit, man. Yeah. Yeah, man. Just but yo, out. back to the Mali thing. We've been yeah, back scream- to the Mali thing. What I want to ask <laughs> We've been is, yeah, it our whole lives. What is the Mali thing? Have you guys, the Mali thing is where, like, the Mali, like, when did you feel like Mali's were being, in where you from, being recognised? Were you guys always recognised, like, for nah. when, or was it only the last five you know, years, you know, ten the, years? You know, there's a difference between me and uh, Brody over here, you know? Yeah. Uh, by the way, I'm neighborhood. He's money for voices yeah, from the yeah, staircase. Give our names. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. But me, I went to school with uh, predominantly uh, Caribbean and Africans, other Africans, you know. Okay. Like West Africans, and my school early on was like very like where there's, there's not a lot of, there's not a lot of Somalis, mm-hmm. and then um, yeah, it was a little different, man. They used to treat us. They tried to treat us funny. I don't know because we look different, you know. But I don't know. The, 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 you know, so you know, it's not right though. Why can there be so much different type of white people? You get what I'm saying? There's like, there's white people from Spain, yeah. white people from Europe, Polish, I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. London, uh, UK, yeah, yeah. Polish, yeah. Russia, Russia yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like Serbia, the, Serbia and the Caucasus, yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? They all look different, but why is there only like one, spe- like one spectrum of black and why is there only the West African or the Caribbean type of black considered black? You know what I'm saying? This I is, don't know, but fam, we're, 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 we're from fam, Toronto. Somali's getting recognized. Maybe in the 90s, they had it rough. They're probably new. They're like The guys older, a little bit older than us, they were new to the country. No, there's so still some that were kind of, like, you know what I'm saying? There's some that getting cracking. There's some that getting cracking, but you know? the majority was like, it was new to them probably. They don't know left from right. They're new but, to society. I was society. coming up, we were there since kids, so by, it was normal to us. By high school, we were in there. Yeah. We were in there. By high school? You guys used to claim you guys, you guys used to, oh, do you guys claim to be black? Yeah. 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 I'm a black. black. We're not Arab, I'll tell you that much. And we don't stand for that. I don't stand for that. Anybody yeah. that says Somalis are not black, I don't stand for that in Toronto. But yo, back to what I was saying though. Um, in middle school, 
There's Ghanaians. I mean, the Ghanaians, Nigerians, all the West Africans used to go on like they used to go on like they're Jamaican. Yeah. Used to be a Jamaican and act like they're Jamaican right out, right out for them, and and you know come but come where in my school, bro. That's where he's from. That's where, where, where I grew up. Where I grew up, the, the Africans were like brothers. To the so whereabouts did you grow up, homie? Like, in the western of Toronto, not too far from him, but like okay. The more in the it north. It's all in the same like area. It's not too about 10, 15 minutes away from each other. But uh, there was 20, 25. Uh, north to no, uh, like no. 20, 20, 20 minutes. No. You know? 12 minutes. 12? 12 minutes. That's what all right. Tough. So you drive crazy, fam. But you see the thing with man, yeah? Obviously, you guys claim yourself <laughs> to be black in it. Okay. Back in the day, did you guys get told in school that you're not black? Yes. Uh, maybe him? Yeah. You got told Everyone from my size will say the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Even yesterday we were talking to a homie on the phone. Remember you say niggas start, they say you're not black, you're Indian. You know, you're not even like you know what I'm saying? You're more Indian than you're not black or some, some, something like that. But that's like way black. That's like when you was a kid. That's bro. what we're talking yeah, about. Bro. Yeah, that's what we're talking about with the kids. We're not talking but about now. That somehow that's left some people traumatized. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. They got traumatized because they was not accepted before. So they're feeling like, why are we being accepted now? You understand? Because yeah, before yeah. they didn't want to accept man to be black, but now because man's getting more recognition and man's getting more Again, me people are knowing us more. Like, how are we being accepted now? And but, why well, we but who's now? acceptance though? Yeah, like, you know what I'm that, saying? Yeah, that's well, what matters. Who, why do I care about what I'm? Like, like, yes. Who are you to me, fam? That guy's you uneducated. Know? Yeah, like, exactly. Who yeah. are you? Yeah, you're so right. the stance is still the same. I don't care. You can accept me, then accept me now. It don't matter. Yeah, don't I know who I was all the time. Yeah, exactly. It's it not gonna change. Sure. You, know, you you have this you have this angle because you didn't really grow up that way. You know what I'm saying? But back when I was going to school, fam, there's like. It's like five of us, four of us, you know what I'm saying? Mm. And they used to rush us in, in, the, in the hallways. <laughs> well, I'd be like, they used to try it. You know what I'm banged out. Yeah, they used to try it. Well, I'd be like, I had to hug it for my first year. Um, so we have middle school, we have uh, elementary school, middle school, then high school, you know? Yeah, bro. So middle school is like from age of 11 to 13. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's, what it was, that's when it was going down. The following year, <laughs> we switched on, bro. I brought a, one time I brought grade seven. I have a story for you. Grade, grade seven, well, I was 12 years old. I uh, we, I had French class. So in Canada, French is a second language. They make us take it, but they don't force it on us, you know? So we had a substitute teacher or supply teacher. What do you guys call supply. it? Supply. So substitute supply. supply. So, Same yeah. thing. so you know what that means, you know? Yeah. If we have a supply teacher, that means... So new head. New no, that, no, that person's imaginary. That person's not there. Well, niggas are, everyone's acting the way they want to act yeah, in school, yeah. you know? That, that period, at least, you know? So there's this one kid that kept on bothering me, bothering me. He was like the leader of all this, like, fuck shit. And he was Ghanaian too, you know? Ghanian brother. Yeah, Ghanian brother, bro. He's the leader of all this. this do, do, can we swear on this? Yeah, dude, you just, you, not. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'll, I'll still refrain from it. You know, he's the, he the head of all that the nonsense. You know, Somalis are not black. This, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, 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 trying yeah. to get people onto me. You know, yo, yo, why'd you cut your hair like that? Why do you have? You know, what's, you know, when you cut, get a cut of Somali sometimes. Yeah, yeah. We have like our hair is naturally wavy. You know. Yeah. He'd be like, yo, he cut his hair like that. Like, I'm like, what are you talking about, bro? My hair. You know what I'm saying? My hair is like. This, yeah. Bro. So this kid kept on bothering me. He's onto me, bro. He's onto me. Yeah. So I brought a BB gun to school. It looked like a real gun. Like you could cock it, everything. Yeah. You know. How old is you? Twelve. I was twelve. Oh my. <laughs> so I had in my backpack. <laughs> well, I had in my backpack, right? So we had. So the way that the class was designed, they make uh, two people sit like this in front of each other. So it's like boxes, like four, 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 four. You know. Yeah, bro. So the kid was sitting in front of me. So I, like I kept on looking at, him, looking at, him, looking at him. I kicked him in his knee. You know? Ah! To look under the, the desk. You know. Look under this. I put on his nose. He did a okay. backflip, you know? Wait, no, he's scared, Yeah, you know? he, well, I did a Why backflip. Why is he just... That, he broke it. He did a backflip. He did a backflip. Screamed. I looked around. The teacher, the substitute teacher looked like she never really seen it. So I put it back in my bag. Little did I know she noticed it, right? Bam, she called feds. No, nothing. Oh, so man. the next day I come back to school. No, after school she wrote a letter to the principal saying, oh, there's a it. student named this, this, that who had a firearm in his bag. Da, da, da. Like I'm never coming back to school. Don't ever call me to come back to school again. Whoa. And she put it in his mail, mail, mail box. Mm-hmm. Do you hear me? Next day I'm walking to school. When I was walking home from that, something told me like I can't take it home. If I take it home, I'm getting my ass handed to me. Uh-huh. My, my brother, my family's gonna beat the shit out of me if they catch us, you know. So I threw into the little sewer. I went home, like about my business. Came back next day. First period, sat down. My six John Cena's appeared in front of my class. Some feds. Feds, fam. Mm-hmm. That's it, John Cena. Yeah. Lifted my ass, bro. Lifted me like this. Hey, dude, Dragged I've me seen out. something like that happen in my Bro, house. they lifted me. Why? Why my nigga? Give it up, Allah. Huru guf, my nigga. Oh my God. They carried me out the class. Took me to my locker. Made me open my locker. Search my locker. They said they want to search your house. I said, bro, I don't, I don't know what you guys are talking about. You know? This lady. I don't they know came, they would have found a BB gun, though. Huh? If, if they, they came, they only would have found a BB gun. If they came that same day? Any day. No, I threw in the sewer. Okay, but after that, school. They would have found a BB gun. Yeah, yeah, they would have. You know? They would have been laughing. Yeah. I would have been fried, you know? 
But uh, yeah, I denied it. I got suspended for 20 days. Funny, my auntie from England was here. Yeah. You know, so she was my, my other hubby was my guardian. So they call, huh. they call her. She was at work. My auntie from UK picked up. She heard it. She's like, oh my goodness. But gracious. I, you know? Told all the family out here. Like, ah, da, 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 you know? Serious, man. Yeah, so, yeah, what? Yeah. so boom. So what out there? So what? See when you do all the madnesses. When the man them do madnesses out there, yeah. What do you guys get? Duncan Ellis as well out there. Is it is it where all these people just like? I got I got funny Duncan Ellis place. I got sent to the worst place. Uh, not like the most oddest place in the world. I think. Where did they send you? I sent my ass to Pakistan. Ola. What? What the hell? Tige Tige. Tige Tige. Yeah. Ola. Tika a Tika Hanji. I was there for like seven months, bro. My dad, my dad was working there. My dad was uh, Oh, that's what album. Yeah, was there. I was there. I was working there. You know. Okay. Yeah, I put, me and my French teacher got it in. My other, well, I had my, my great, were they, were great they hard 10. to you out there great, as well? Grade nine, stuff like that. They had the kids were out hard to you out there as well. Grade it? ten, I failed grade nine. They're grade mad 10. racist to him, huh? They were racist to you. He had a little Indian lover back there. Back there. <laughs> he had a little girl, a little girlfriend. <laughs> uh, <I'm> <laughs> <talking> <laughs> <about>. <laughs> they could only link up. When could you only link up with her? What times did you link up with her? Oh, my dad. Talk like, about her, man. My dad, my dad Tell the man like, about your little Pakistani girlfriend. So, yeah, she's half Pakistani, half Guyanese, bro. Her, she was from California up there. She was gal. And tell him how old you are. I was 15. Oh, man, you're a big man, though. I was 15, my dad. Tell the man about the so, flexes, fam, in Pakistan. It's, it's him. So I'd go to school from Fajr to Duhr. Yeah. My dad would go to work from 11. By the way, Fajr to Duhr is... Oh, 6 p.m. to like 1 p.m. 6 a.m. 6 a.m., sorry. 6 a.m. to 1 p.m., you know? And then my dad would work from 11 a.m. to 11 p.m. Yeah. So I come back from work, one, I have 10 hours to my face at home. Yeah. By myself, and I'm in the city by myself, you know? So yeah, I should ring her, tell her to come. She'd have to come and like sneak into my house. Yeah. That's pretty much it. But yeah, I was in Pakistan. Other things, funnier things. Why he... That boom. He's leaving out. See this guy? I don't like it. You see this guy? He's leaving out shit. All right, all right. I don't remember. Yo, she was on to me. All right. He wants me to talk like this? She okay, was on to me, bro. Do your thing. Yeah. She was on to me, you know? Yeah, I was the only on. nigga from North go America. On. To, she's seen. She's from California, you know? So I was kind of tall in class, yeah, you know? Yeah, they used to make me. So it's like boys will sit on this side, girls sit on this side, you know? So they make me sit at the back of the class, you know? Because I'm too tall to fit in like the, the front desk. Yeah, you're going to be blocking everyone, yeah. 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 Homegirls sitting in the back row up to you know how Pakistani girls wear kameez? Yeah, <laughs> like yeah. They wear like short short kameez like yeah. up there and they wear pants yeah. underneath, you know? Mm -hmm. Homegirl used to unbutton like her like last chest, like yeah. seven <laughs> and just show me everything like this in the back of the class. Her hairy chest. Holy fuck. <laughs> What's a hairy chest on these? No, nah, no, nah, it's not hairy chest. Nah, this guy's just pushing. She's pang, though. She's pang. Lang in it. Pang, pang. Wallah, pang. Wallah. Her, her name was Rama. Rama, yeah? Yeah, black. Yeah. So, boom, you man, yeah? So, you man, yeah? All right, cool. What? How old are you, man, when you first come on the roads, bro? I was 15, fam. When I started getting... I, I, uh, you I, come out on the... I started getting in, introduced to life at yeah. 15. Really introduced to like... Yeah, you know? Yeah. Outside or like... Oh, no, is it, on, yeah. Was it knowing, going on is it knowing what's going on? Or is it like... Yeah, like out here. Drugs. Like, or we're out here like, doing whatever. Yeah, mashing work, or robbing people, shot, oh, shot yeah, weed. Like, fam. 15, 16. When I, 15, yeah. 16, I started learning about but, drugs. I started yeah. learning about... Every other, all the other things. Yeah. I grew up, I grew up in a small town, you know, before, uh, from the age of like 11, six to 11. <laughs> and 11. that's when I, at a young age, I knew what crack was and all that stuff because back in the day, it was only Somali people were only allowed to go to some other Somali people's house, right? Yeah. So when I was a kid, I was sitting on the floor, like, I remember I was like, maybe like, I was six or something. I'm drawing, you know, chalk on the ground. I don't know if you guys have that culture here. They give you a chalk and you just, just scribble on the concrete. Yeah, we used to do hopscotch. Yeah. So we're scribbling, we're scribbling stuff. My neighbor... Imagine I'm arguing with a 37-year-old woman with mental health because her parents are smoking crack or doing drugs when she's pregnant with her. And she has a mind of a seven-year-old, bro. And me and her are coloring on the ground together, arguing over, yo, give me this red, give me blue. I want to color you on blue. Yo, give me red, you know? And then my, my other neighbor, some Somali brother, is going door to door to door to door to door. I'm looking at him saying, yo, this guy's going to get in trouble. What are you doing? Like, why are you, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Why is he, why are you going to this, you know? Come be like, hey, what are you, how are you doing? Rub my head. Give me like two bucks, three bucks or something, you know? These little coins he had, you know? Mm. I get so happy and stuff. And then when I got a little older, I realized you were selling drugs. So my, my, my dad and my brother told me, he's like, oh, yeah, let's go for real, you know? If he gives him money, you know, just throw it on the floor. Like this, I don't why, blah, 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 you know? Yeah, man. So you say, yeah. you, man did, you man started banging out, and what? You man started banging out um, um, basketball. How did you guys buck up? Oh, I mean, meet up, yeah. How did you meet up? I mean, balls, man. Ball. Young. Yeah, back Ball, Somali, yeah. like, Somali, back in Toronto, football is that like, soccer, in it? Yeah, we have like little Somali gyms where most of the people there are Somalis. Is it a youth center? It's like a Somali a man. Center. How do you explain that, man? Uh, no, it was like a Somali guy who used to get a lease for like a, a gym inside a school, and all uh, the boys are on the same age from every side of there. Toronto would every come there. Most of the neighborhood, yeah. 
So we're all like from different neighborhoods, the same age, playing basketball against each other or playing with each other, you know? From young, from young. Yeah. And did you guys all did you guys want to be ballers? And yeah, hell yeah. We all had the dream, fam, but yeah. that dream went away right right when you enter high school, your first day of high school. When you get introduced to life, I feel like you get introduced to life in high school, real. Yeah, yeah really. Right. But we don't, we'll, like, the, the reason, we never got support, like, for, for sports. If my marks were not up to par, my family would be like, you're not playing. Or if I got in trouble, be like, you're not playing, you're not allowed to go outside, you're not allowed to do this, you know? And Somalis never really cared about nutrition, bro. Basi, Brisi, you know what I'm saying? They're out. Yeah, yeah. We're, not, we're not working, they're not like training us, you know what I'm saying? Doing like workouts, do this. But we have the game. One thing I'll tell you, Somali, the niggas can't say about Somali niggas, we're saucy. When it comes to basketball, we're saucy, <laughs> but we're not hug, you know what I'm saying? We're not yeah, like, got, yeah. yeah, we don't have the bounce, yeah. you know, the jumping ability yeah. like these, these uh, you know what I'm the saying? Other we, yeah, you we're, the you know thing? we're yeah. saucy, you know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's the only problem. And we like, you know, we never got so, too much support about it. But now this next generation coming up right now is Mashallah, they're, 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 they're doing, they're doing yeah. numbers, isn't it? There's a kid from Toronto named uh, Ahmed. Big him up. He scored 103 points, Shout out, shout out, shout out. Shout out, Ahmed, bro. You know how that's, like, nobody's ever done that, like, in history of basketball. Maybe like five people, three people. Ever. He's got 103 points 103 in the basketball points. game. Bro, they averaged like 103 LeBron, LeBron, points okay. in a high school game. That's LeBron, crazy. LeBron, Kobe. That's crazy, bro. It's crazy. LeBron That's and ridiculous. Kobe them averaged, they averaged like at their best. 80, 90. No. Imagine. 30. You're lying, bro. Wallahi, brother. Mashallah. 33. Imagine one of these soccer players scoring like. 15 goals. Like, no, no. 25 goals in one game. And that's crazy. Now that's by crazy. himself. By himself. It's madness, bro. It's crazy. Well, Drake like, put on his jersey after that. On, on he stage. slapped it on. Yeah. He put he on his high school jersey. Wore it at a, at a concert. Yeah. One of his concerts. Yeah. Shout out, my dude. Well, I, yeah, man. Big up him, my man. I'll protect him. I mean, I mean, I mean, he's, he's, he's you know what I'm saying. He's, yeah, I think he's, yeah. he's coming to the Euro. I think he's gonna play for the Euro soon or something. You know. Yeah. He's gonna try for try for the NBA. Euro or uh, Euro League, like the probably like Barcelona. I don't know about basketball and them things there. Yeah. But boom, watch this now. Yeah. All right, cool. So you've gone into the basketball thing. So you said the first day you went into in high school, this is when life you're is You're exposed serious. to everything, fam. Exposed to everything, you're exposed yeah? Drugs, you're exposed to did you mind, did you mind used to bring like, did you mind used to bring like food and stuff like, has she should done that to mum's house and that when you were shotting? On the level or did you used to Oh, no, we used to stash it. You used to stash it outside yeah, and come inside? It. Yeah, we used to stash it somewhere. I'm not gonna lie. Stash I brought some gathered in my house a couple times. Yeah. One of my no, but gathered like you know, not not a gram or two, like you know, like I'm a couple ounces. I'm talking about a couple. Of them. Yeah, you brought it. I'm, take, I'm taking that. My gram. sister found it. I used to hide my everything I used to have. I used to hide in my police. It's fucked up. Because <laughs> <laughs> nobody's looking in the throw pockets. When yeah, my sister the found smell. it, she's like, "What are you doing? Is she smoking?" So I'm like, "Nah, I'm, you know." Hmm? Yeah, hiding in plain sight. Yeah. 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 Nobody's but how about the though. smell though? Yeah. You're young and dumb, fam. <laughs> Did you mind used to use eye drops and stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, just, <laughs> I, like, <laughs> I like when the whole you, you see when the whole you locks into your eyes, yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's it, it's a wrap. No, but do you know what I used to do? Do you yeah. know what I used to do? One day, my mom. All right, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. One day, I just, okay. just bumped, I bumped a spliff. I see my mom. She's looking at me. She's like, Why are you looking yeah, at me? Like, nah, why you keep blinking, you know? What's wrong with your eyes? I'm like, That's what I have to eat. Nothing, nothing, nothing. She's on she it. knows you well. No, but me personally, what I used to do every time I used to get high. Uh, yeah, cause I don't smoke weed no more. I used to mm -hmm. smoke a lot when I was younger. Mm -hmm. I used to walk into my crib, do the exact same routine I do whether I'm sober or high. I walk into my house, I yell at the door, say I'm here. Uh, close the door, slam the door hard, lock it. See my little brother, chase him around, try to hit, hit him. Go inside, <laughs> wash my hands, wash my face. Say what's the, what's the, is there any food? Blah blah blah. Go upstairs, change my clothes, come back down, eat my food, and then. Get the hell out, like go in the basement or go in my room or something. So you'll never know if I'm high or sober, you know. I always do the same thing. That's how you um, do. Have you man? So, what tell me about the gangs and stuff in your hoods, fam? So, what is it? Is everyone mixed up or is it just Marley's like just stick together? Or no, no, it's not like first of all, here it's fam. There's two things that shock me about London since yeah. I've been here Marley's and um, non Somalis yeah. beefing over skin color. That's shocking. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy to me. I mean, we, we, we were talking about that, but we kind of slowed down until stopped. Fam, that yeah, shit, yeah, yeah. that shit is crazy to me. I've been asking him. I've been trying to get to the bottom of that yeah, and try to understand it, make sense of it. It doesn't make no. It's I don't I, I don't know where it derives from. Like the what do you mean skin color? Be we're beefing over what kind? No, of, yeah, who do you guys are beefing over? You guys are beefing over Africans. Non, you yeah, over like it's two black but people. That's what, no, that's what I'm trying to say to you because it's it's coming from a hurt place because you're not accepted once upon a time. Mm. Man are saying to themselves, how on earth a man's getting accepted now? Well, you know what? I don't even want to be accepted. Mm -hmm. Man's man's own thing. Understand? Back in the day, you know, like maybe you know, even back in the day, like four or five years ago, I used to scream at Marley, bro. I never used to say I was black. Mm -hmm. 
No, but uh, generally all Somalis are like that. We're never ever clean or something else. Yeah, I'm some man's Mali, bro. Man's yeah. Mali, innit? But, but for me, Somalis are black. So when I say I'm Somali, I'm saying I'm black. Oh, I thought that's what I thought. I thought that's what I thought. What did you say? You said no, Mali, not just Mali. We're just Mali, bro. You know black? That's what yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're just Mali. Like. He was, oh, you know what we're, we're, own, we're yeah, our own yeah, people. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, we're yeah. our own people. I heard it wrong. Bro. Like we're black as hell. Man, that shit is crazy to me, man. When I say Somali, I'm black. I'm saying I'm black. Bro, when they see when I was in school, bro, man, I say you're not black, you're not white, you're green. That's what I used to say. Make that make now. sense, Ola. I know, but man's think man's chatting to idiots. Mm-hmm. And the girls, girls will be like, oh, so what are you? What country are you from? Somalia. Oh, you're Somalian. Is Somalia's even black? Okay, can I, I want to say something real yeah, quick. The UK brother. is different, Wait, I man. Say, no, that brother, is I big. Like, yeah. I want to say something real quick, brother. Um, you know when we were growing up, people would be like, oh, you're what's Somali? What are you? Uh, but the girls would be like, oh my God, I want to have babies with you. Oh my God! You look at how. What do we name our kids? <laughs> I you know what I'm saying? Right now, everyone is. Are you man? Well, they never used to really like. <laughs> even I only, I the niggas, only the niggas used to hate on us. That's it. The, the men, the, like the guys, used to hate on us. The girls never used to really give a, give a damn. Nah, like, okay, oh my God, that's, that's like, only on his side. Yeah, and that's, that's only on my side. A too. handful of people. I'm not gonna say that didn't happen all across, but that 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 wasn't a regular. It's only now. You see, the younger generation, they got the name pumping. Mm-hmm. The thing is pumping. Everyone wants to be Marley's. Everyone wants to put in their songs. Mm-hmm. This, that, Marley, this, Marley, that. They want to try breathe some bars, store, all of that, all of that. Mm-hmm. You understand? But before, bro, it was none of that, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Any fam? No, but we're, time, we're, certain we're, time, we're, even, not even, certain time, man, they used to go to certain guys and say, bro, man, where are you from? Man's literally in still. How long? I how long ago? No, because man's getting shut down. Anyway, go Central London right now. I'll be you. Go Central London, you, man. This weekend, go Central London. Just walking there. I'm trying to walk into a club. They say, that's what the bouncers are going to say? I'll fuck it to a bag at the face. You stay there, fam. <laughs> yo, yo, shout out, shout out to bouncers on their best behavior yo. where we're from, Allah. Right, where where yeah, you from? Where we're from. One, there's one brother, you know what I'm saying? Big him up. Yeah. yeah. He's a real one, yeah? Knocked off a couple of them. <laughs> yeah. All the charges are knocking them off, Allah. Allah. You know what I'm saying? Like, with the bouncers, everyone, like, they can't, they, you can't racially profile a group of people and tell them they can't come inside. What the fuck is that about? Like, 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 break your gone, windows. Everywhere I've gone, bro. Everywhere I've gone, I can't even get in, bro. Fam, when did it? Where's the okay, nitties, fam? Where's the bisons? Send the bisons at them. Huh? Send the bisons at them. Yeah, see? Yeah. Yo, when did it become... You said you said uh, recently that everyone wants to get on a Mali tip. When did it When did it start? Like, when were everyone started hopping on the Brother, board? the thing kicked off when BLM kicked off. When it was Black Lives Matter... Like, two, huh? 2020? Yeah, recently. April, bro. March? Before, George before COVID. Me, for, before, yeah, before COVID, bro. That's when he kicked off. That's I said, right. what, now we're black? What, because you want numbers, bro? Wow. Before you didn't care about, man. But you see now, but obviously it's cool. Don't get me wrong. I've got, I got, uh, bro, now I've got brothers from different, I've got brothers that are just That's thinking. what I'm saying. Me and my niggas side by side. Go, yeah. Me my brother sweep all 10 mm-hmm. times. You get me? That's my brother. You understand? Like he's closer to me than certain people that I grew up with my whole life. 100%. You understand? That's what I'm and saying. they're more loyal, innit? Like, I, I won't judge a man on his background and stuff. I'll judge them on the circumstances. But with our mindset, we automatically assume that because he's Somalian, that he's going to treat us better. And he's not gonna sneak us. We should not close doors on ourselves. That's not me. Yeah, that's, that's what me. that's what fucked me up. Because the only people <laughs> that have actually snaked me out here is only be Somalians, bro. Fam, I choose like, Rachel. Mm. We get too comfortable with each yeah, other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And man, watch each of us pocket. And remember earlier when I asked you, man, two questions. So what? I was like, oh, so what? Who makes peas out of you, man? Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. the next question I was gonna ask you, so what? Why didn't you look at his pocket? Didn't you never used to look at his pocket? I'm thinking, mm. oh, why is he making more money than me? Or I don't watch my niggas' pockets. Yeah, we don't do that. Yeah, I don't watch yeah, my niggas' pockets. Certain... No, don't get me wrong. There's certain, um, certain hoods. Niggas are loyal, but certain hoods, niggas are sky. Bro, where I'm just... from, niggas are sky. Fam, that's just... Bro. Any man watching next man's pocket, you're weak, fam. You shouldn't be watching next nigga. You should be go out there and get oh, it, go, get it yeah, yourself. Yeah, that's, 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 that's some bitch ass trades, you know? Yeah, or, if we, or, or if you want the, the blueprint, ask your homie for the blueprint, bro. Yeah, but when your homie gives you the blueprint and he teaches you the thing, you're gonna act like he didn't teach you nothing. Yeah, then you're just a waste man. Ah, yeah, well, yeah, like, yeah. are you giving the nigga the whole blueprint? I said, what? You didn't even know how to spell. Man, man. see, that just goes back to your character, character, yeah, 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 your yeah. morals and all that. You know, yeah. that's what it goes back to. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know. That's that's that's, that's really odd to me. You know, you know what I'm saying? There's uh, of course there's, there's how do you there's those people in tar- the, where we're from as well. You know what I'm saying? There's people yeah. who like pocket watch, people who uh. Oh, who like uh, hold the, close the door from you? You know what people I'm saying. People like that everywhere. There's, 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 people like that everywhere. Yeah, brother, yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I like this everywhere. It's not just everywhere. But yeah, everywhere. we don't. We don't. Fam, the way I we see it, fam. Mind, bro. We, cut, we cut our grass. Fam, I live a life. You know what I'm saying? We have a circle small. I live life one way, fam. Either you're saucy or not. You know, <laughs> <laughs> that means like either you have it or you don't have it. Yeah, you're, you're goofy about, or you're not a goofy. Yeah, yeah. It's not even about real. It's like it's either you have it or you don't have it. You're not a waste man. You know what I'm saying? 
You're solid or you're not. Wallah. You feel me? Bam, what was I going to say to you? How is it like right now? How do you guys feel when, like, how do you feel? What do you think about the, in, how, how's the sisters where you guys from? The Marley sisters. sisters. The, the girls? Marley's, yeah, they're the cool Marley. people. Well, like, there's, they're good. I got love. Anything, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I got love for my Marley hard. sisters. Shout out to all my Marley sisters. Yo, bro, the first nah, one, I got working Somali men. Fam, I got none bad to say yeah. about Somali girls, bro. Yeah, well, like, I got none they, bad to say about Somali girls. Do you know why they're working harder and they do harder with men? Because I got to go they was looking. They were getting looked after. Mm. We was getting told to hit the road, Jack. Yeah, understand. Yeah. We was on the roads doing our thing and stuff like that. Mm. They had time to focus on their education because mm -hmm. they had their parents hovering on top of them. Mm. They got their whole year. Because yeah, you know this, the, the the female. I mean, sorry, female now is a derogatory term apparently, right? So um, women, what? women in the what females what? <laughs> the derogatory. You can't say fe female no more. Apparently, so I don't know. Voila. That's what you, I don't know. That's my, so my shout out my baby sister. sister. It's gone mad. My baby sister told, 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 keeps me updated about everything. You know? So like she keeps you updated. Yeah, yeah. yeah don't, say that, don't say that. You know? <laughs> but um, you know, like uh, the, the 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 girl or the woman in the family is like the pride of the family. You know what I'm saying? They're, the they're, 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 they're the, you know they're your flower, bro. You know what I'm saying? You have to raise them properly. You have to make sure they don't get damaged. You have to make sure like that you know what I'm saying? they're yeah. watered. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's your pride. Like you know what I'm saying? If, if you know what I'm saying? If your sisters, you know what I'm saying? Like you have to make sure you have to. Everyone has to put focus on their, the women in their family, you know, because if if you teach a girl, you teach the entire community, you teach her, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Women, are, it's good. I feel like it's good for them to be treated like that. Because yeah, now look at them. They're all, strong, they're all honorable. The they're all cool. honorable queens right now, you know? The girls are cool. It's only when they, they, they really understand what's going on on roads and shit. They don't understand that lifestyle. Yeah, they should stay away from when it. They, well, yeah, they should stay away from it. When they try to get involved, like, you guys don't know what's going on. Now. Yeah. Going and on. How, did they f how did they look towards Somalian brothers? How are they? It's love. I think they're accepted. They're yeah. Do, 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 do they rate the brothers out there? Yeah, it's a nah. small percentage. Don't, they, don't don't. Say, they don't say Marley brothers are trash. Uh, yeah, that's their favorite Come, line. Not Come on, man. Let's oh, no, 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 Come on, no, we're no. here, man. No, 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 no. They do say that. They do say that a lot. There's and no you, they've, got, they've got every right to say that. Yeah, they got it. However, they got it, right? it's hard out here, Do you man. think that's uplifting us or is that breaking the brothers? It should uplift niggas. To, to, to wake up. That means they should get it together, fam. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. These girls just want a nigga that's going to stay home with them, chill with them. Be cool, you know? Yeah, reassure them, tell them they love yeah. her or whatever, you know? They're, they're not asking for much. Well, like they don't. I don't think these well, like they're asking for a lot. And they deserve a lot because they've done a lot. Yeah, if they ask for a lot, that's... They're good. asking for a lot, bro. If they, but you they deserve bro, it. Bro, I don't know. If, they, I don't know. I don't know. Know. if a girl's done, done, gone school for 10 years, yeah, you're telling me this brother is just saying, you know what, fuck it. I'm just going to go... Hit, I'm going to come for the roads. I'm just going to go and get myself an Uber job. I'm going to be a cab man. And that's fam, but a lot of girls are allowing it now, fam. Mm. Do you, well, you think she can? You think so? They're allowing it now. Because there's Swear no... Down, bro. bro, you'd rather have the Uber driver than... You know what I'm saying? The chat boy. Yeah, fam. Swear down, brother. I swear. They don't want to see... They don't want that right, Sticky. Yeah, man. They just girls just want a just, girls just want a man. Women want a man. That's it. You know, they don't care about what you do. At certain stage, they stop giving a fuck. They're, yeah, they're taking, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We're all going for Marley's. We're all going for Somalis. Uh, Marley, you guys even say Marley's? Do, 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 they, are we not allowed to say that as well, innit? Yeah, no. More times, they, the more times they, they call us Somalis or Warriors or we no, no. I'm us. Can we call ourselves Marley's? Yeah, why yeah, not? Nice. We, we are Somali. But people say, I say people say we can't call ourselves Marley's. We have to call ourselves Somali. Because no, oh, I see a Mali, Somali. Because of the country, man. Yeah, I got a lot of hair, my nigga. That's what you want to say, man. It's <laughs> <That's laughs> us, it's us, us. We made it poppin'. What the hell? Did it? Timbuktu is the last thing that was popping out of Mali, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. yeah, that's the, that's it. I know. I never heard of nothing from about Mali before, mm. my nigga. Okay, so how do you feel about Mali and the Mali's going into the music industry? I got you. I think you, man. There was a couple, man. Who you got? Is, is, is that Presser, brother? Somali, not sir? No, no. Presser's not Somali. Presser's He's not Somali at all, isn't it? Jamaican and uh, Filipino. Filipino. I knew it. Yeah, yeah. Filipino, People Filipino, trying to tell me you're Somali. I no, didn't no, know no, Jamaican. No. He just said, Filipino. his neighbor has a lot of Somalis that they, they're so close He's to. Holding it. Yeah, He's holding they're holding close to. Yeah, they're close to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do you feel like the Somalis getting into the music industry? What do you want makes? Well, we're the land. We come from the land of the poets. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Our wordplay is 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 pretty good. You know. Yeah. Like we think different. We're very different people, you know. Okay. We're, we're, our culture is like uh, very similar to some, but different to a lot, you know. And yeah. we're really talented in that field, but you know, if they want to do it, they do it. If they don't want to do it, they, they don't have to do it, you know. But I feel like they're excelling. Do you think, do you I think feel like they're excelling. Do you think it's a positive thing for the younger generations that are coming up? Fuck the way I see it with music, fam, is it's better than on the road. It's, yeah, it's better than yeah, the road. Like road. even though even though in our religion is haram and all. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, go on. Fuck, if they could get a ticket for music and leave music and... And own their masters. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Take a different route or get something, get something like an endorsement or something out of music, cash out, get out of music. It's cool, you know? Yeah, I hate what you I mean. Yeah, but that's that's only when it comes to the greater of lesser evils, you know what I'm saying? Instead of them on roads, fucking... 
Yeah, they shot die, him doing you know this. Saying? They get arrested. Why go for the lean thing, bro? Lean? <laughs> yeah, welcome for the lean thing out there. The drink? Yeah, people drink lean out yeah, there. Lean, you're welcome for that, though. Don't you think man's slurvy, bro? <laughs> the drink. Hey, bear man gets slapped over in it when they're on, on lean, innit? Uh, no, That's some... when you're slipping, innit? Yeah. Oh, but yeah, I also Slip feel that. But people only drink it in their house. Yeah, when they're indoors, there's not around no one. They're not, there's some people no, drink but it I also out. feel, I also feel the lean, the lean, the pill game, all that in Toronto, raised the oh, fucking pills, crime. Oh, what pills? But Xanax, isn't it? Z- Z- no, nah, nobody raised Perks. Perks, I mean, yeah. What yeah. else? What else is going on there? Lean and perks. I don't know if niggas are on oxys yet. Yeah, yeah. You know, know what I'm saying? Nice. Minnesota is crazy. But I feel like that shit, all that, raised like the crime rate. Because that shit's going to fuck with your head. Niggas are waking up angry doing random shit. Ain't that heroin though? Opium. The lean is yeah. heroin. Yeah. Opium is is yeah. liquid heroin. Yeah. Lean is liquid heroin. Yeah, opium ain't that heroin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So don't you think, don't you think, because we, we come from, as you say, we come from the land of poets, yeah? Mm-hmm. Like our ancestors mm-hmm. never used to do not our, 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 our granddads and get me or they mm-hmm. actually never yeah, used to do yeah. this. Get me, they never used to do this. Do you know why they were so strong? But they were getting high like off different Chad. things. Chad, but that's Bro, that brother. their own thing. Though. Nah, How about the mad bro. mula? I heard that guy was getting yaks, getting on his horse. Dustin, bashing work. Yeah, <laughs> that guy's a top demon. And he I had don't, po- I don't he... know about getting yaked. Don't say I don't know about getting yaked. Yeah, I don't know about getting. Yaked. Okay, I'm not gonna say that. He's a chef. But yeah, imagine what is it? When I take a shot of this, chef, maybe you're talking about. He said, I'm not scared. I fear nothing. We can what assume whatever it is, bro. We don't know, right? We don't know. <laughs> from, I heard it was yak. I'm not going to say it's yak, but I heard it's yak. Uh, He's getting nah. yak dust. I don't know, man. I don't know about that, you know. Auntie, don't, I'm, uh, I'm not going to put that on him. Yeah, don't put that. That's all I'm saying. The point, that I was making, the point that I was making you, man, I'm saying, you lot, like, you know, people from in, in African Caribbeans mm-hmm. and in European people and in, in Puerto Rican people, their grand and their grandfathers and stuff, they have, they've got liquor in their systems. Look what's going uh, the reason why Baluda uh, is breaking Somalis more mm. and they can't handle their liquor and stuff like that because it's not in our genes. Mm-hmm. Wouldn't you agree with that? Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. You can see you me? Don't you think without us having these and um, and these um, Baluda and stuff like that and these um, being, and being drinks and stuff like that, don't you think we'll be more stronger, more focused? 100%. 100%. 100%. Don't you think? And you, how many guys have you seen on the roads that your bridges that your guys, they fell off? Why did they fell off? Because of the Baluda, right? I'm no, I don't know. No, it's not because I need that, bro. Why? Oh, go on. No, How there's been niggas that fell off completely, man. 100%. Ain't it? They're saying, man. There has been. It's, it's more mental health than it is anything else. Mental health is serious. You know what I'm saying? That's like an excuse sometimes. Nah, bro. It's a, how what? did mental health kick in, bro? It's through the drugs and that. No, not even. What? Mental health goes with what they've been through in their life. How the trauma. The traumatic stuff yeah, yeah, they, yeah, they yeah, went through. The uh, their yeah. family uh, their family dynamic. Yeah, the upbringing. Upbringing. They might have hit their head somewhere as a kid. They might have had a bad concussion. They might have... You know what I'm saying? They might have dealt with bad teachers. They yeah, might have. Actually, that could be there's, there's a lot of things, bro. People resort to it to find their. To, to, they they feel so like you, they feel like they can find their peace yeah. through these means. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. These drugs and stuff like that. Yeah. But that's not the case. You know, instead of finding the, the, their peace through the dean, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Or even going to a therapist. You know, yeah. people always say, "Oh, it's because the drugs." Or it's, it's not, bro. It's before the drugs. You know, what what led him up to the, the drugs? You know what I'm saying? Hundred percent, man. You can go some fucked up shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's it's that first. You know, Toronto is a. Yeah, it's true, man. Bro, we, a lot, yeah, how, how come we a lot of people took glasses. Bro, how come we don't acknowledge the elephant in the room, bro? We come from war-torn families, bro. Our parents might have had PTSD. We might have not known. I know. A mother, that's, a mother went through had PTSD yelling at her kids, bro, every single day, you know? Mm-hmm. That kid growing up angry, you know what I'm saying? Led them to doing stuff, you know? Mm-hmm. That, that, we, we, we didn't know about, P- we didn't know about uh, mental it's, health yeah, back then, you know what I'm saying? I just learned about mental health. Yeah, about me, we, we, years, the last, years maybe? yeah, that's three, four years. We do. Would you say on the level of my homie? We have PTSD. But would man them say they, they, they suffered mental health? Yes. We are, 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. 100%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you, would be, you, you we know that, fam. We all know that. We I know that. Those who are, those who are going through it? Do you, don't you think they should look for help? No, we need to find oh, the salah. bro. Salah, salah, yeah. is the only means, bro. I feel like there's no or talk to or, or talk to therapy someone. Therapy too. Therapy. Or, I went therapy. Bro. Therapy can help. Yeah, man, yeah, or therapy, therapy works. Sometimes or, you need to talk to somebody. Yeah, because they tell you things that you meant to know about yourself. Mm. I started learning certain things because, as you say, PTSD. I had a lot. Of, I had a mad upbringing, bro. Mm. I've never been to high school in my life. Yeah. In my whole entire, I got kicked out when I was eight years old. Yeah. I've never been to high school. I used to be that kid who used to wait outside the school for the kids. Mm. You understand? Mm. All of that. And as I told you, I was in care as well uh-huh. for a couple of years, innit? Get me like, because I was just very active. But however, because of that, that ended up affecting me when I was older. Mm-hmm. So what I'm trying to say, there's a lot of young people right now who are 16, 17, 18, thinking what they're going through is not going to affect them. It's mm-hmm. only going to kick into them later on in life. By then, they're going to be too old. Get me? So I'm saying to them, right, the moral that I'm trying to make right now, mm-hmm. if you feel like you're doing something, you're going through something in life, 
Go search for that help. Go seek for that help, my brother. That's what true. To life? Fam, go to the The dean's the most powerful mm. thing, first of all. Mm. All of this, all this um, secret, law of attraction, all of that, all of that. These mm. men just broke it down from the Quran, from the Quran mm. and they made it into their own thing. Mm. That's what it was, you know. They yeah. broke down their own thing. But what I'm saying to you is, yeah, there's people out there and there's people you can look for help, man. 100%. I'm telling you, man. Fam, I tell myself man. all the time I'm going to go see a therapist. There's so much stuff that I wouldn't tell any other human being, nobody. But I wouldn't mind telling a therapist. Me for, I, have, I have a different opinion on that. Go on, my brother. Huh? Go on. I don't know. Ther- therapy is good. You, you think it's washed. Sam, no, hold up. Before you say your opinion, you, think it's soft. you have to understand there's times when, bro, there's a lot pe- someone might want to say, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not, you know what I'm it doesn't take, what I'm, what I'm saying is it depends on the person. It doesn't take away from people who would go to therapy. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying anything to make therapy look bad. Mm-hmm. Some people might need therapy. Some people might need that right question someone might ask them mm-hmm. to, bring, to, to trigger something in their brain to... Realize something about themselves. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? But me personally, I don't like telling... Uh, uh, me personally, I feel like therapy is good to an extent. You know what I'm saying? But I don't feel like you should tell your entire life and your weakness to... Uh, you know what I'm saying? To somebody. You know what I mean? No. But Allah. Yeah. That's, that's it. Uh, your entire life. You know life. what I'm saying? Like, uh, people, Why? Like, you're Why? literally, you're literally that giving... That insecurity? That no. you being insecure? Or no, no, it's fam. not being insecure. There's some people that have fears, fam. You wanna, I, I, you get just, it, fam. Like, I get it, you know? I get it. I get it, fam. I get it. My whole thing is, why give your entire... Like, what? why give... One person, you're like the lock to your brain. You know what I'm saying? Like, they know what triggers you. They know everything about you for the rest of your life. Who cares? Yeah, I don't trust that shit, man. I don't. I don't trust people, man. <laughs> I don't trust. Yeah. The, I don't know, man. Fair we can come to. I don't know, man. I've got, man in, I've got man in from Canada. I don't tell him everything. Me, certain man that shout me and they go obviously because of the lean and stuff like that. Saying yo, rehab for a lot, yeah, bro. Mm-hmm. And this bro, I said go get help, brothers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, rehab's bro, different. See when there's brothers that are out there. Rehab's if you different. see man them in your hood mm-hmm. and you know they're going through stuff, yeah, brothers, make him direct him to the right people. 100%. That's what real niggas do. That's facts, facts, facts. facts. Don't watch your people break. Yeah, facts. Don't you that's facts. Rehab, rehab's Trust different. People. Rehab's different. When I'm, Trust I'm me, you have, to, you have to pattern people up. Yeah. That could be you one day, man, nigga. Yeah, 100%. You don't know, blood. I swear to God, Allah is the more merciful, you know. Facts. You, you have to keep it rude. That's how you keep each, each other strong. Fam. 100%. Man. You understand? And 100%. that's it, don't Because I know there's people, you know, like, like, like there was certain people in my, in my hood, like, like not in my hood, but in, in London, yeah. And they were, they were all right when they were growing up, you know. Mm-hmm. But as soon as they got to a certain age, they went started going through certain things in life and they fell off. Because mm-hmm. what people started doing, they started cutting them off. That's, you see, and that's fake. Fam, fam. Oh. See, that's a big that. thing in. Don't do We're that. in the city right now, fam. They do that. I've seen so much communities right now, like niggas that group each other, friends. Yeah, because my man fell off. Drugs got involved right now, yeah. and niggas, it's not like when you ask yo, you still fuck with that person? Yo, he's a waste man. Yo, he's this, he's that. Nah, that's that was your man. Man, you man don't do that's that. That's your man. man. He's this. He's well, a liar. He's this. He's on, he's on this drug. He's this that. They have everything in the world to see. Yo, that was your man, fam. What happened? He was a real dog. That was your man. He's uh, he's he like that now. Why don't you check for him? Why don't you help him? You know what I'm saying? That was your man. Me, I'll don't never that, leave man. one of my niggas. Hold your people. Keep I'll, each other strong. A friend of mine, I'll never leave a friend of mine, even if you had a small relationship with me. If you're going through something, I'll be there for you. Yeah, that's Straight. what's up. Well, that's what that. real niggas do, I'll man. I'll be there for you. That's Call me anytime. Real niggas do, Call man. me anytime. I'll be there for you. I get me, fam. That's what's up. Tell me, well gone. Well gone. Tell me about the, the prison system in Canada, you, man. Who's been jailed at you, man? Both been to jail. You've been jailed, yeah? How long did you do, homie? No, not, not per person. this time, but arrested. You got, you got, uh, what, you got six months, three months? The way less than that. Just in and out. You know, are you in yeah. police station? The most I've been jailed was maybe a week. No, no, yeah, yeah, that's this county jail. This, this, this guy rubbed me. He said, you said he was on a wing wing. He was on a range. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he was yeah. on the range. You're telling me, tell me about the range. Yeah, it's all right, man. It's all right. You, <laughs> <It's know? laughs> you had a range called the pirate ship, you know? The pirate ship, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah Is that yeah. the wing, yeah? yeah, yeah. Uh, was it all Marlies on there? Like, uh, yeah. 13 out of 30 were Somalis, you know? I thought you guys were solid. You guys stick together. It was fun. It was fun, yeah? No, nah, I'm not saying jail's fun, but like... No, nah, I'm saying you, you guys... You yeah, like, you know, we jail, bro. Yeah, yeah made, fuck jail, you know? You make the most out of a bad situation. Yeah, absolutely. You know what I'm saying? We had... Uh, was it, was you intimidated? Your first, how was your first night in prison? No. Uh, nah, let me tell you a funny story. Go on, cousin. Every time... I've been arrested more than once. You guys are protective custody here, right? <laughs> what, what? <laughs> <laughs> you guys are protective custody what, here, what, right? On the Like prison? PC. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's the, the vulnerable wing. Yeah. yeah, what is it called? What do you guys call yeah, it? Yeah, vulnerable wing. Yeah, yeah, you called it the, the money. general population. The VP. Fam. Yeah, yeah. When you're younger, you hear stories about jail. Every time I've ever been arrested when I was younger, when they ask you, yeah, you want to go to PC or not, I thought about it. <laughs> I asked me, should I go to PC? Then I thought of all the bitch niggas I knew in my life that went to jail and survived. 
And then go on. Bow. Bow. You know what I'm saying? You had it. They asked you, you want to go on there or not? Yeah, they asked yeah, you. Sometimes you want to ask your name. Never, fam. Well, guess what? No, they asked you, though. They yeah. asked you they when ask you You don't check in, but yeah, you want to go this place or you want to yeah. go this place. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, that's what they ask people because they said there's, bag, there's, 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 there's a lot of gangs in it, in mm. London, in it, so they ask you, bro, like, mm. let me know because there'll be certain man's ops in a certain wing. They'll be like, bro, I don't want to go in there. I know certain man, yeah, that were on road, clarting off the thing every day. What that, 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 that. Brother, as soon as they came jail, <laughs> VP wing balagale. The NPC? Yeah. Of course. Wow. Because he don't know how to fight. He didn't Still, fight. man. He was just mm. shooting people from... I've seen the skinniest niggas survive in jail, so I'm smiling. My nigga, my nigga, one of my niggas, yeah, I'll tell you a story called B. One brother called B. I don't know, it's on my YouTube channel, mm. yeah? It's my brother, yeah? Big up B, yeah? Watch this now. I've come to the jail now. B is more slimmer than you, bro. Mm -hmm. Very, very slim. He's, mm. around, he's around... Six, what are you, 6'2", six, 6'3"? Six, like six, one. So yeah, it's around roughly around your height. Yeah, watch this now. B, he's come to the jail. I've come to the jail now. And I go hand the high 18 by Nahimaka. That jelly can so gully. I heard B and B's in the jail, innit? But B is my older brother's mate. You know the one that I was telling you about? He's his brethren, innit? So but I was not thinking B is on anything. So I've gone to the mosque now. As I've gone to the mosque now, I saw B mm. looking all, he didn't put in no weight enough. I'm thinking, bruv, how are we gonna but guess what? Before I got to the mosque, yeah, mm. I was in the induction room. They're like, yo, this one brother called B. This one brother called B. Mm. He's on job. He's on Somalian brother. No one don't want to fuck with him, you know. So I'm thinking in my head, it can't be the same brother. Yeah. I've gone to the mosque. I've seen him. He's done a mad thing. I think, ah, oh, now me and him have to bang out together now, bro. Mm -hmm. I'm not thinking he's not even on it. I don't even really know him from the road. That was my older brother, Virgin. Mm -hmm. Fast forward now. He said, say no more. You're going to get moved over to, um, to my range, innit? Obviously, to my wing, innit? Bam, gone to the, uh, gone to the, gone back to my soul. 20 minutes later, the govs open the door. Are you B's friend? Yeah, come, let's go. Pick up your bags. You're coming with us. Mm -hmm. They're fighting each other. They're saying, nah, rah, B's not your friend. He's not your friend. They're fighting each other. Nah, B's my guy. Mm -hmm. Soon as I come onto the wing. You Who, who's saying this? There are two officers. They're the guardians. Oh, wow. They're saying, no, he's not your guy. He's not. He's my guy. Mm. I don't want that. Nice, I? I feel like I'm, bro, I feel like I'm, I'm Eddie Murphy coming yeah. to America, bro. I, I feel, yeah. So, bro, I've come to the wing now. Soon as I come to the wing, bro, the guy that was next door to me, in the next door to B, yeah. well, Haliguri, I love Haliguri. You're getting, you're getting moved upstairs. Yeah. They swept the whole cell. They put me next door to B. Yeah, he had it like that. Eh? Yeah, he had it patterned. Mm -hmm. Damn, who's in the mosque? I'll tell you one next time. Fam, like you said, anybody can shoot anybody far. A big thing now is in Toronto, kids are coming around different neighborhoods. They're shooting from far, shooting innocents, just yeah. random people walking. Yeah. It's a, it's, it's, it's a norm now. It feels like a norm. And it's a shoot and it's a every other month, month, every other yeah. two, three weeks, every other two months, three months, some uh, innocent person. Mm. I knew I was a leader. Mm. So I didn't watch face. So every person I saw, man, them that I used to see, that I used to rob, bro. Mm. I used to stick up. I'll go to work, I'm making like $10, $20, and this guy's making two, three bags. And I look at him and I saying, I can do what he's doing right now. Mm. You understand? But it took me, it took a bigger man to choose this in this path that I chose. Yeah, absolutely. And it's for the sake of Allah. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I humbled myself. I looked like, dude, good. And I'm there, I'm on, How I'm, happy I'm, are I'm you on my chain. How happy are you? I'm happy, bro. Happy, right? I'm happy. I'm Chilling. good. I'm happy. I'm happy, bro. Mm -hmm. it's only, I'm happy, bro. Why? Because I got Allah. I love Allah, man. 